little peasant boy named Juan. Okay. And he was walking home from work one day, and he was walking, it was December, and he was walking through the snow, and all of a sudden this vision appeared of the lady. And the lady came out of the snow, and she had on this beautiful cape, and she said, I want you to go and tell your bishop that I want a cathedral built in on this spot. And he was just astounded and stunned by her. And she opened her cape, and in her cape were roses. And they were live roses. And she said, take these to your bishop so that he will know that you had this, that it was a real vision. Because roses don't grow out of the snow in December. So he went to the bishop, and the bishop, he had a hard time getting in to see the bishop in the first place. Nobody wanted to talk to him. So he persisted, and the bishop said, well, you have to go back. You have to get another sign from the Virgin. So he went back, and he went, and he knelt in the snow, and he prayed to the Virgin, and she gave, she said, she opened her cape, and um, she gave him roses, and he brought them to the bishop, and so then the bishop, I think, came with him and went to the spot and said, I will build a cathedral. And so that's the cathedral of Our Lady of Guadalupe. And her feast day is December 12th. And um, that's the story. Tell us about the mola here. Stand in front of the quilt and tell us about well, the mola. Well, the mola was made by one of my students, and I wish I could remember her name. But she said, I will make you a lady mola if you will trade me some of your house quilts, house blocks. So I made her some house blocks and sent them to her. And then I was absolutely astounded when this beautiful mola came. So I had the mola for almost two years before I really decided how I was going to represent it. And, uh, so lots of times it takes me a while. I have to think of things. I have to um, really kind of mull it over. And, um, but this, is, I think, is a good example of using the same style fabrics. Mm -hmm. You're like the Mexican roses. Right. And they looked very Mexican to me. When did you complete this? Oh, probably about six months ago. And who did the quilting? Um, this is um, Judy Irish. 2013. No, I made, made it in 2013. But that doesn't mean it was quilted then. Um, 